I'm doing a look younger anti-aging makeup tutorial today to get this look. It's going to be faster than my other tutorial that's up on my channel because I'm going to speed through some of the parts. And I have a lot of redness on my face and um, some comments from that one were that without makeup I look like I'm 70 and with makeup I look like I'm way, 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 way younger than I am. So I don't know if all of that's true, but yeah, people don't recognize me when I'm not wearing makeup. It happened a couple days ago when I stopped by my gym with makeup on and they don't know who I am. I also got a lot of redness. I was really red on Saturday. I'll post a picture here. Um, I was outside mowing the lawn and it just was really hot. And yeah, I had that red face for hours. So let's get started, show you how to get this look and some ideas for looking younger with makeup. And I'll be speeding up as we go. I'm starting with Ulta Color Correct and I'm going to be using mostly these two colors. Next, I'm using one of L'Oreal's BB creams, and I'll have all the products linked in the description box below the video. Next is foundation. I'm using Emlyn's uh, foundation in burnished ivory, but just a little bit. Now I'm ready for some powder. I'm going to use this Press Powder Stay Matte from Rimmel. To get ready for doing my eyes on, in a bit, I'm going to put on the Smashbox, um, what is it? Eye primer, <laughs> eyeshadow primer. I'm going to do just a bit of contouring and I'm using a contour stick by Sonia Kashuk. One of my favorite things to do is to add some highlights and I'm using Emlyn's Under Eye Cover Cream. For years I used this actually under my eyes. Um, it's a little lighter. I'm, I'm liking a peachier color under my eyes, so this has turned out to be a great highlighter that lasts all day. Now for a bit of bronzer, I'm using Paula's Choice Bronzer. I decided to go with a pink tone blush color today and I'm going to use two. One is this Dusty Rose that's no longer made by Paula's Choice, but I'll link in the description box below other colors in other brands that are very similar to this. And then I'm going to top it off with this Studio Gear, which is a pinky color as well. I'm going to start putting on a lot of blush and then I'm going to take some off. Now I'm going to add some Too Faced Candlelight, just as a bit of a last little bit of highlighter. I'm going to do my eyebrows using the e.l.f. eyebrow kit. I believe this is in dark. I only use, flip it open. I only use the dark pomade. I don't use the lighter powder. Now 
Next, I'm going to cover it up with some lighter powder, and I'm using the Urban Decay Naked 2 Basics, and I'll just um, pick from some of these lighter shades. If my lashes weren't so light and blonde and small, I probably wouldn't do this stuff. Now I'm going to start shading and I am going to use a combination of these. Of course the lighter color um, on my lid and below my brow bone. I might pick an even lighter color from another palette and then with this color, the second one, I'm going to use that above the crease as my transition color. And then in the crease, I'll probably combine these two. I usually stay away from the darker colors because I'm a klutz and I might make myself look weird. In this IT palette, most of the time in their palettes, they've got this um, piece right here that's shiny. So I'm going to use a little brush that I probably took out. Where is it? This one. And just put a dab on the inner corner and even on this side of my nose. If I really want to glitz it up a little bit too, I'll put some right above, right in front of my where my pupil would be. I'll do it. Just a little bit. Now it's time for mascara, and I'm going to start with my small tube of the Benefit Roller Lash. All right, so let's get this all together. I'll put in some lip color. This is the finished look. So does it make me look younger? Hopefully it does. And hopefully you enjoyed this little tutorial and my fairly quick get ready. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Bye. I started using a weekly glycolic peel. Um, it comes in a box like this by Perfect Image. If you want to see it this way. It's a 30% glycolic peel. And I'll link in the description.